Hi, Arya, it's here, and welcome back to our adventures in Azeroth. Last episode, we slayed 10 Teradax and 15 Frenzy Teradaxes, and we also got into some PvP action. And we did that for Spraggle Frock. Hey, how you doing? And today, we're going to do another Hi, quest for Spraggle Frock. We're going to do the quest Lost. You've got to help me, Flag Carrier. My friend Ringo left earlier to explore the volcano to the south of here. And he has been gone way too long. I am really worried about him. Do you think you could find him? Why don't you take my canteen with you? If you don't do find Ringo, I'm sure he'll need it. Find Ringo at the Fire Plume Ridge. Be careful out there. Oh, we gotta watch out. We're going to the volcano, guys. In the middle of Ungoro Crater. Before we do that, we're gonna have a little chat with Gibbert. Talk to me. We're gonna repair our gear and we're gonna sell all this gray crap. That we got inside of our bags. We almost have 30 Angoro slime samples, which is nice. Happy about that. But we do have a lot of junk. We have a lot of junk on us that we need to get rid of. Always have to do this from time to time. I have to look through my bags and sell some junk. I think I might just get rid of this mace. It's a decent mace, but I think we're just going to sell it. And I think that is about it. I think we'll keep everything else. We've got a decent amount of slots left, and we have the Spraggles Canteen that we're going to be using. And I'm also probably going to use the armor. Should I use the armor buff? Yeah. We might as well use the armor buff we collected yesterday as well. I also, yeah, I forgot. We also, um... We're gonna run away from these guys. I don't want to fight Blood Petal Pest. But yeah, yesterday we also uh, went to all of the the pylons in Ungoro Crater. And we got some buffs from them. Went to the north, west, and east pylon in Ungoro Crater. And we got this buff, Crystal Ward. I believe we got this from the western pylon. Increases target's armor by 200 for 30 minutes. And then we got Crystal Spire. Crystal Shield surrounds the friendly target, doing 12 damage to anyone who hits him last 10 minutes. We got that from the Eastern Pylon. And then we got one more right here, the Crystal Restore. Heals the target for 670 damage. We got that from the Northern Pylon. And because we did a, a quest where we got a book called the Crystal Pylon's User Manual, and then we read through that and we uh, learned how the pylons work, and and we uh, got some buffs from them. Pretty cool stuff. And Girl Crater has a lot of good good stuff in it, man. Tons of PvP. Cool little pylon system that rewards you with buffs if you feed it gems. And it also has a bunch of dinosaurs in it. Gotta love dinosaurs. Oops. I used my lifestone by accident. Okay, so let's roll out here, guys. Let's go to Fire Plume Ridge. I usually try to stay away from this place because I'm not a fan of fighting fire elementals. But I guess it's something we're just going to have to do. Because we got to save Spraggle Frock's friend named Ringo. There we go. Oh, this is a... Uh, this is actually pretty tough. This is an uh, orange quest, guys. These guys are all full 55 elementals. But good thing we have, um... We have stealth. So maybe we'll be able to uh, creep around here. I actually want to try fighting one of these guys. Should I try fighting this blazing invader? He's level 56. It's going to be a tough fight. We're going to give it a try. Here we go. Let's see if we can defeat a blazing invader. Well, it's looking pretty good right now. Unless he starts really pumping the damage. This guy's resisting a lot of our attacks. Alright. I'll be pretty confident if we can defeat this guy. He hits hard. I'll give him that. It's looking kind of rough right now. I know for a fact we can't fight two of them at once. And they give a decent amount of XP too, so it goes like almost 800. 
We gotta be careful. Can't pull two of those at once. So here we go. Let's climb up this volcano. And we will uh, try to find Ringo. Looks like he's probably in one of these caves. Hopefully we're going the right way. All right, so we're climbing to the top. You can see the, the smoke going out of these stacks here. Okay. Well, it looks like Ringo's down here. See this like thing right here? It says lost. It's cool that they're helping us find him. We found a little cave right here. We're gonna deal with this living blaze, I guess. Oh, he's he's gonna deal with us. There's Ringo inside the cave. I'm gonna put the canteen on our bars. I, think I might as well. Where's that canteen? Fraggles. This guy's beating us up. Guess they're paying attention. We might, we might die to him. Okay. Got some coal. And here's the canteen. We'll just put that right here for now. It looks like I can't put it anywhere. So let's heal up quick. I'll have a little chat with Ringo here. He looks like he's on his back. Looks like he fainted. Whoa. What? Oh, I'm so glad someone found me. Ugh. It's so hot. I was exploring this area when all of a sudden the heat just became unbearable. I must be suffering from heat exhaustion. Please help me get back to my friend Spraggle at Marshall's Refuge. I think I'm well enough to follow you there. I'm feeling a little out of it, so if I do happen to faint again, just splash some water on me from Spraggle's Canteen. That should work, I hope. So we have to lead Spraggle to, uh, Spraggle, lead Ringo to Spraggle Frock in Marshall's Refuge, and looks like we'll get some, some loot we're most likely going to sell. Okay, well, I think we're ready to go. We're buffed up. And, uh, I think I'm going to put the armor buff on. Might as well. There we go. Got that armor buff going. And let's, uh... Let's help Ringo out. Hopefully the Alliance don't ruin our party, but we'll see how it goes. Well, I'm not sure how far I'll make it in this state, but I'm feeling kind of faint. Remember, if I faint again, the water that Spraggle gave you will revive me. Okay. Well, we're gonna get out of here as fast as we can. That is gonna be our plan. And we're going to try to dodge. It's good that we don't. he doesn't lead us. We lead him. So we're going to have to fight this guy if we want to get out of here. That just looks like it. Okay. Well, it looks like we don't have to fight him. The heat. I can't take it. Oh, my gosh. He's getting in a fight with a blazing invader. Hopefully Ringo does not die. we got to save his life. I thought Ringo was going to be able to creep by him. I guess he doesn't have the sneaky abilities that I have. Let's get rid of this blazing invader, then we might have to might have to do a little do put a little dose, splash a little water on Ringo here. There you go, Ringo. Get up. Let's go. Okay. All right, speed it up, Ringo. My gosh, look at that. Got a level 60 pallet in there fighting a devil sore. That's interesting. I think he's gonna. This is a pretty close fight. We should probably heal up, actually. Before we get into another fight. I wanna see if that paladin can defeat Ring. Can defeat that devil sore. Oh, well, yeah, he's gonna do it. He's got bubble and he's healing up. So we better get out of here before uh, he notices us. And decides to take us out after he takes out this devil sore. Yeah, it looks like the devil sore went down. 
And we need to start going north. And here we go. Come on, Ringo, follow us. Now it looks like he passed out again. What's he doing? Ringo, you okay? Oh, he passed out. Okay. Revive Ringo. Let's go, pal. Okay, for some reason all these oozes came out of nowhere. Come on, Ringo, let's go. You don't have any time to waste. We got we got 20 minutes to get to a Marshall's Refuge. That shouldn't take too long. As long as we don't get ganked. I'm gonna start going a little north here. Gotta make sure Ringo's following us. This would be the worst time for the Alliance to gank me. Because I'm on a timer with this guy. I have a feeling if I die, I'm probably going to have to go back to, uh, to find him again. Good thing is we're level 52, so a lot of these beasts were able to, uh, run by. Oh, it looks like he's going to fall down. Doesn't know where he's going. Okay, well, let's use the canteen on him. Get up, Ringo. Okay. Okay, we're gonna have to fight. I had a feeling this Dimetrodon wanted to fight. Well, we'll deal with him. Might have to fight some of those, uh... Those oil guys. Those monsters that like to hang around the oil... Oil fields. Now let's keep going north. Is he swimming? There he is. Yeah, not a bad quest. It shows you where Ringo is. I think he's in this cave. Or maybe one of them. And, uh, yeah, not that bad of a quest. It's nice that he follows you instead of you following him. So it makes it kind of easy. The only thing you really have to worry about is, um, dying on the way there. Making sure you keep an eye on Ringo so when he faints, you, uh, you get him back up. And if you're on a PvP server... You need to watch out for the, you know, for the opposing factions. They might try to gank you and troll you while you're doing this quest. Okay, well, it looks like we're as far north as we can get. Now we just got to go east. See, Ringo's going to fall down. You going? Okay, he's falling down. So you got to pay attention to Ringo. Because he, uh, he likes to, he likes to fall down. <laughs> Gotta keep an eye on him. Come on, Ringo, let's go. I don't, I think he'll be able to make it to Marshall's Refuge before he falls down again. He moves kind of fast for a goblin. Now we're at Fungal Rock. I think we'll try to get away from all these gorillas. The Angoro Gorillas. We haven't checked that cave out yet. The Angoro Rock Cave. Still have a lot of time left. Which is nice. Come on, Ringo. Speed it up, man. We got a little bit further to go. Once you get to the northern parts of Ungoro, this quest becomes pretty easy. It's kind of hard when you're around here, though. Fire Plume Ridge is where it's the roughest. Because you got to deal with those fire elementals. But as long as you can deal with the fire elemental, you should be alright. Lucky that that mage was on our side. That would have been an interesting battle. 
would not have only been fighting for our lives, we would have been fighting for Ringo's life as well. Alright, well, well we're, we're homeward bound now. Hopefully he doesn't faint before we get there. Yeah, look, he's still going. Oh, we have an alliance here. Should we fight this alliance mage? Looks like Ringo's gonna pass out. I wonder if Ringo will fight for us, dude. You think Ringo's gonna fight for us? Here we go. Okay, we must go on. Yes, I agree. And we must fight this mage, Ringo. If we want to guard, get into Marshall's refuge, we have to fight this mage. We have no choice. So let's deal with it. Oh my gosh, big hits, boys. Big hits, boys. See you later. That was a huge hit. While well, we defeated the mage guarding Marshall's refuge. Peekaboo. Peekaboo, Bio. I don't even want to say his name. I want to see what I hit him for, though. We hit him for 1,092 damage. Big crit. There we go. The heat, I can't take it. Are you serious, buddy? He's passing out again. Now we gotta fight. We gotta fight the pests. I hate the pests, dude. Just gotta put bleeds up on him and they'll fall over. Gotta love it. We come here and the pests ruin our day. Okay, sit down. We gotta save Ringo for one last time. It's like, where am I? <laughs> Here you go. Come here. You're in Marshall's refuge. It was all a dream. Spraggle, I didn't think I'd make it back. Ringo, you're okay. Alright. Oh, I'm feeling faint. He's fainting again. I wonder if he's fainting due to the heat this time. Do I have to use the canteen? Ringo, wake up. Don't worry. I'll take care of you. Yeah, what do you want? Well, what a love story. A little help from my friends. Ringo's not the not in the best shape flight carrier, but I am glad to have him back in one piece. All right, well, I guess we'll take the plate legs. I think they're going to be worth the most glad amount of gold. And we got 5,650 gold. And now we got some more pests attacking us. Gotta love this about Marshall's Refuge. These little plants. That are just... That are so aggressive. Okay, come on. Do they bleed? I thought these... I guess plants don't bleed. There we go. Okay, well, let's sell these pants for a gold 23. Not bad. We'll get rid of this burning patch. I guess we'll keep the coal for now. Right back. We still have the canteen for some reason. But that is it, guys. We saved Ringo and we brought him back to his friend Spraggle Frock. And that is the end of the episode, guys. As always, thanks for watching. Keep your heads up. Later.